like a cartoon. It's very impressive, like the results that you get. Uh, hi, welcome to this new video. My name is Sergio, I'm a computer vision developer and consultant and I help companies, freelancers and students to easily and efficiently build computer vision projects. Today, we're going to see a very exciting thing, how to convert your picture into a cartoon. And we're going to see this in very four, four simple steps. Let's go. Uh, before we move on, you need to know that the notebook that I'm going to use will be free to download and I'm going to put a link below in the description that you can click and access to this notebook. Plus, I'm going to give you a bonus that you will get directly into your email and this is called Computer Vision Blueprint is a free workshop that will teach you how to detect and track any object even if you have no experience. And now that you know this, let's start. Once you click download source code and then you click on this link, you will access the notebook, which will be a Google Cola notebook. So you don't have to install anything because all the processing and all the operations will be done online on this ready notebook. To run this, you just need a Google account. So if you have Gmail, you have a Google account. Everything is for free. So if you don't have Gmail or Google, you just can make an account to run this one. Now, as I promised, this is going to be very simple, probably the simplest you will ever find. It's only four steps and most of them are just automatic steps and you don't have to do pretty much anything. Let's start first of all to by installing. So by running the first cell, so we have four cells. The first cell is anime gun v2. So when we click here, uh, this is going to install the repository, which is called anime gun v2. Now we're going just to install and try and use them. But later I'm going to give you a more background about this project, about its founder and how you can know more about this. Uh, when you run the first cell, it should take less than one minute. So around 30 seconds, one minute. So I'm going to pause while this is installing and you will see this moving when it's still in progress. So let's wait. So uh, the first cell was executed, so the installation has been done. And if you want to see more details, you can just open the cell. And this is the cell, here is the output that we get from that specific cell. Now, step one is done. Let's go to step two. What is the step two? Upload images. Of course, if we want to convert our pictures to a cartoon, first of all, we need to have pictures that we want to convert into a cartoon. So what should you do? You should, first of all, get images. Uh, I'm going to give you an example of the images that I have right here. Uh, I have four just selfies. So one, two, three, four. This works with any scenario. So you can put a CD, you can put animals, you can put whatever you want. But I want to give you a suggestion. All the elements that you use must be big. Just to give you an example, if you put a picture of yourself, you need to make sure that you are very big on the picture. For in this case, my head is at least in height half of the screen, so half of the window. Because the smaller the element, the harder it is to convert this into a cartoon. And it will not look that much as a cartoon if you put like a picture with like 1000 people inside. So the best result you will get with such picture you must be very big or the element like if you use a dog the dog must be very big in the picture it not be and it can't be a dog very far away on the nature for example once we have the picture from the folder you need just to drag and drop them inside another folder so uh, here we have the folders of our google collab we have Animegan V2, which was installed with step one. Then we have images, which is empty. And this is where we need to put our images. So we take the images from our computer. I'm going to select all of them. And we drag and drop them inside images right here. And you will see they're uploading because we see here the list of the images uploading. How do we make sure that the images are correctly uploaded on that folder? we can just click on the arrow and just search what is inside the images folder. And here we should see 
the list of our images. I'm using JPG format. It works pretty much with most of the format, either PNG, WebBP, so it will work, work with different formats, but if you want to make sure to avoid any mistakes, go with JPG and you will you'll be safe. So step two, done. Now, step three, transform photos to cartoon. So the step three is the one that is finally going all the processing. So it's going to take the library anime gun gun v2 and it's taking the picture and converting them into a cartoon. This should take a while, probably around 30 seconds to one minute. Keep in mind that the more images you have, the longer it is going to take. Generally it takes around 10 seconds to process each image. So I will recommend to start with like a couple of images or just one. Then once you are confident about this, that is running well, then you can finally convert all the images that you want at once. Also, uh, cell number three has been executed. Oh, and now at this point, we are ready to see the result. But before going to see the result, let's see some more information about what we're using in some background. It will be very quick. Uh, what I'm using right here is an open source project, which is called Ainmegan GAN version two, which is based on GAN, which is a generative adversarial network, which are based on deep learning and they have one specific purpose, recognize specific patterns, in this case, the patterns that cartoon have and bring the same patterns into other things. In this case, we bring the cartoon patterns into our own original pictures. So this is the open source project. I'm going to give you the link uh, also of this project on the description. And so let's shout out the credit to the, for this awesome project to its founder, which is Asher Chan. I hope I'm pronouncing this well. And I'm also going to put the link of the author below in the description. So what I, what I just did was taking this project uh, bringing this into a notebook to make things very simple to run, but he's the founder and there is much more to this project. If you want to know more about this, you can, for example, change the different types of cartoon. You can train it to use your own cartoon. So it's a very interesting and big project with a lot of potential. And now that you know about this, let's finally see the result. First, we install AnimeGun V2. Second, we uploaded the images. Third, we transfer the photos into a cartoon. And four, we can download the images. So I'm going to run this cell. This is simply going to put everything into a zip file and then it will ask us either to download. So either open or save the file. I'm going to open the file. And here we have the four images. Before moving to the four images, let's first of all open one by one the original. So we have image one, the original, and this is the cartoon. Pretty impressive, pretty impressive, I know. Uh, I was very surprised when I worked first time with this project. It's, it's just great, especially like if you check all the details, like the face, like the hand is exactly like a cartoon. It's very impressive, like the results that you get. Uh, let's see some other example. So I have this one, mostly they have no background, but later I have also one with the background. So we have this number two, which is similar to the other one. This one, I have different shirts. Okay, this one, nice. Uh, it can be also on a videos. So you can not just convert your images also on a video. I, I didn't implement this one yet. So let me know if you want also to use this on a video. If you want to see more about AnimeGun version two and make sure that you download the link, uh, this code from the link below and also that you get and watch the free workshop that I'm going to give you as a bonus. This is all for this video. See you on the next one.